Okay, round three. Here we go. You ready, Ashin? I'm totally ready, Dennis. Let's start the round. This is definitely me, and I'm not actually downstairs having a cigarette. I don't know about this hand, Dennis. Well, I think you're right, Ashin. I don't think this hand's a keep. I think we got to send this one back and see if we can do better. This is a little risky, but with this turn three play and the grapple with the pass to dig for land, I think we're okay. Yeah, I think we're okay, too. All right, we're going to keep this one, I guess. Gosh, Dennis, you're so smart and good at magic. Ushin, please, save it for later, okay? Probably going to bottom the five drop there, I think. Going to go from here. Yeah, we just say forest, say go. Yeah, I think that's probably what we do, too. Oh, boy. Here we go. Okay. So, finals of an 8-4, so we've made our money back. Yeah. So, and then some, I guess, because a pack is worth more than two tickets. Yeah. So, pretty happy with that. I don't know if we're going to be able to win. Uh, like we said, we weren't exactly confident in our deck to begin with. But hopefully we can pull it together. Yeah, I mean, it's performed better than I thought it would so far. But, you know. So, yeah. Mm. <laughs> we put the five drop on bottom. Then we can end up drawing a six drop. Yeah, that's kind of awkward. Yeah, it's not great, but... Let's grapple with the past here. Mm, just take this island, I'm afraid. And have those go away. Yeah, it just has to be done. So we freeze our opponent place, hopefully we can profitably prey upon at some stage, and then accrue value with this, and then land a big beef and try close the game like that. Now, obviously I don't know what our opponent's playing yet. Yeah, it could be anything. Cracking the Terrarian now for a three drop, so we'll see how that goes. I'm not excited about that. Yeah, me neither, buddy, me neither. Topple, guys, why did he crack that though for me? Ah! No, that's awkward. It's going to get really very prey upon. He's not even going to get to attack with it. A land next turn is good because it lets us play um, Nibbles and Prey Upon. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Let's just play Nibbles and Prey Upon at once, which is nice. And then Nibbles trades for the Change of the Dawn Griff, yeah. Back in a second. Sorry about that. This is what I've been doing while you were gone. You didn't pause the video or anything? No. <laughs> All live. You're a terrible person. Content creator, yeah. Uh, Nibbles of Dusk, Prey Upon, you're this. There's just going to be 30 seconds of nothing happening in this video. I said I'll be back in a second. We have a pause button. Yeah, we do. We want to kill the topple guys over the griff. Over the griff? Yeah, I want to get that griff spin out of there. The moon comes back. Yes, yeah, before I actually that though. I'm also willing to trade these now. Especially then he doesn't have a target for the griff. Exactly. Forest does a great draw here. Yeah, I mean it's not it's not if he boons. But if he boons we can just swing past it. Hmm. He's already got an artifact in the bin, I wanted to just nip that Toppelgeist because it was gonna get annoying. Well we just put an enchantment in the bin. I suppose the Toppelgeist is coming in. Forest, 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 da, da, da. forest. No trades. Forest. Forest. Because it could draw first. Nice. Nom. So now he gets a 4 3 flyer. We get to attack for two here, and then we're if he attacks with if he just if he just boons and attacks, we win that race by massively. A margin. <laughs> yeah. Um That's the mo the Kessig Darius one is the most expensive card in our deck so every draw is live right now which is great mm -hmm. like land is good because we play a swine spells are good because they're spells because you can play them all what's our best possible draw um I suppose seasons pass is our worst possible draw yeah that would be pretty bad and you've got to cast it it's not bad 
It's not great here. But if we draw seasons like, fast, we start trading aggressively. I love how you're like, I love how, and you're right to this, you're like, it's not great, but we still get, we pay six mana to get a prey upon, a grapple of the past, a lab root, and a land. That's not bad. No, it's fine. And, well, we can't cast it that turn. Station. Oh, sure. Yeah, of course. Like, that's that's the worst draw in our deck. Don't be... I was worried about that. Equip Ooh. cost equip cost three, though. So we got a turn. We got a turn to do something about that. Hmm. That's a good draw. I don't want to cast it. Why? Because I don't want it to get exiled to the missionaries. I want our elk to get exiled to the missionaries. That means we're not doing anything this turn, though. Yeah, I don't like that. That seems to be fine, though. Because this way he gets... Remember, this thing becomes a 6-6. Six, six. Six, six. And we'll be left with these. No, I, I think this is fine, because he can't attack with it. Why? Because then we double block and get our masterpiece back. I guess... I think I think playing the masterpiece is fine. Gosh, I don't know. Okay, I'm going to attack with the Niblis. I I'm, I'm not sure about the masterpiece. I'm not either. I don't think we do it. I think we just attack with these two. He spends his whole turn doing this, and then we just play a six-six fire and win the game with it. Okay. Okay. You know. Well, I presume we play a five-five flyer. Well, we either draw. I suppose if we draw a spell, it's a five-five. Yeah. Brump. Brump. No, I... Mm. We, still, we can still do We've done it now. Not really. No, we wanted to leave the mess and the, the stag back if we were going to do that play. Well, not the stag. Oh, uh, yeah, I suppose. And we just win the race. It's on 10 now. You know? Yeah, maybe we just... We can still just play it. you got to pick something. I don't know. I don't... This I don't is really think, hard. I don't think we play it. Because now, our 5-5 five, five flyer kills him in two turns. Sooner even with the stupid nibbles. Not sooner. Well, not sooner, but like, I mean, it'll, if it hits him once, he goes to three, and then this will just kill him. We chump with this, like, it's fine. I think this is fine. I think, I think not doing anything this time is correct. Okay. Weird turn. Now, it sucks if he just chooses to not equip, but I can't imagine a world where he does that. Hmm. Well, the only attack is a 5 5 this turn. Because it doesn't flip until the end step. So he did that. Which we were expecting. Mm -hmm. Also, if we draw that one, just play the swine. It's not terrible. The swine's fine. Okay. Didn't attack. No. Exiles the elk. Him not attacking there was really good for us. Oh. Exiles the niblis. That seems. That makes more sense. Incorrect. No, why? Yeah. And with it, without the context of our hand, I suppose. Yeah. Alright. Fafa Fleur. Can still double block. Yeah, we still have that line available to us. Now we must deal with this. Pretty sharpish. Two turns. And then if we draw a line, we can play 6 6 as well next turn. Get him to 4. Oh, we obviously. Actually, he definitely doesn't exile the stag, because the stag gets to fight again when it comes back. Sure. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's slow. The and this well. also gets to free something when it comes back. I mean, that's less relevant, but if you're going to pick between the flyer... No, and yeah, the this definitely makes sense. Hitting the nibbles definitely makes mm -hmm. sense. Faith Unbroken would be annoying. Oh, that'd be brutal. <laughs> I mean, we just need to draw a dragon under then. Grispoon. Did not think about that. So what is that name? Uh, seven six. To land is a great draw. Awkward. Not really. We have to. We wanted to play two things so that we could actually. Oh rumble. sure. Uh, but now we're playing this werewolf. Yep. Yeah. Kind of a stalemate here. Hmm. A lot of our draws are good. Mm-hmm. Like I say, all, all of our draws except Seasons Past. Seasons Past are good here. So 23 out of our 24 draws are good. Mm -hmm. We can, interestingly, instance we grow our Gauss Messenger with the Flash guy. Oh, that's bad. Okay, now we're in trouble. Uh 
I mean, if you attack, you attack back. For lots. For harder. You. That's strong. Attacking still isn't amazing for him. No. Yeah, he just doesn't. Which is good. Dire Swine, here we go. Oh, that's really good. So any spell now is great. Freezes that out of the way and Crash gets in for in. two hits with this, and one of them's for four. Probably kills him. Any spell probably kills him here. Sorry, I say spell. Insert sorcery. Yeah, if we had a dragon or something, we bounce this and freeze something else. Yeah, like most of, most of our spells interact with the creature. Bounce that puts the Griff's Boom back in the vein, and he has to spend mana again to make something flying again. And we get our Nibbles back. Mm -hmm. And it costs him seven mana to exile it. Mm -hmm. And he exiles the other Nibbles at that stage. <laughs> But I have to imagine that somewhere within him doing that, we kill him. Dragon is actually an amazing draw here. It's probably the best draw. Mm -hmm. What else is good? Land is not amazing. I mean, we just played this one. Gone Missing is okay. Gone Missing is really good. Really good, actually. Because he has to draw the Inquisitors then. Mm. Or the Missionaries is lovely at that stage. Stalemate. Give me some gas. What do we hit? We hit the forest. That's good. So we play our swine. How big do you get? You one money. more. Uh, it does. We can. Oh, we can't. But he still picks up blocks. <laughs> what? Um. How like, How much before we can just kill him? Um. How much does the wolf cost cost to flip? Seven. That's what I was checking. I said how big are you? I meant. I meant. How much you cost to flip with seven? He becomes a four six. That must be blocked. We have we have delirium, so the six six gets blocked by the six seven six. <laughs> the means you can just attack with this pretty freely next turn though. Yeah, it's a good attack. Sounds like my computer is struggling. With what? I mean, maybe there's something about this new the way with the new recording software that's just really taxing. You know. Yeah. I don't know what it could be, but maybe you know, maybe there is. Collective defiance is good. He kills our nimbus of frost. Then he pumps his flyer. Hits with it. For a punch. Does he even attack? Yeah. <laughs> Does he? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. That's eight. Yeah. So he does kill us next turn. Mm-hmm. Which means we attack with everything? Yeah. How? It doesn't really matter. Right, okay. So we've got six trampling power, so we're just going to assume that's not going to get blocked. So he blocks the four and the two, and we lose. Take the two. So we need to draw something. With the drag under. Or, no, we just drag under the Lunark. Get so get so we, we start with an attack with not the werewolf, because that's blocking well. Uh -huh. So definitely the this swine, and this. probably the stag, possibly the... Stag tries for one of these. But then he's double blocking with it and we're getting in a ton of damage, aren't we? We're getting it for six. I'm thinking about attacking with the mangler as well. Oh. Mangler's well, not a great Mangler attack. bounces off this, still blocks with these, and then it kills both. That seems fine, actually. But do we need the mangler on defense? Remember, we drag under, we get a and we can flash this in. Yep, okay. So I think we're okay. So we don't think we need the mangler on defense? Because this blocks two things. Yep. Yep. And it actually has seven toughness. Yep. So that should be fine. Sweet. And especially since he's going to lose guys here. Mm hmm. He has to lose guys here. Tight game. Very interesting game. It's game one. It yep. is. <clears throat> I wish this wasn't so crap. Nice. That's just good for us, I think. It's just straight up good for us, yeah. He goes to four. He'll have one creature left on the table. And we'll have a bunch of stuff. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. God, we get so much mana advantage out of this drag under. Mm-hmm. That's worth... Like, that. he's put four... 
9, 13 mana into that thing. And we're dealing with it for 3. He's like, oh. It's not a bad one. Sure. Um. There you go. May have been correct to hold on to that. Yeah. Just for, uh. Bluff thing. No. Uh, we have. Advanced stage ring in our deck. We have to draw and have it die, though. Mm. And if that. I mean, if. We will have killed him by then if he hasn't killed us. I would imagine. That's fair. I'm just playing the numbers. No, that's fair, that's fair. It doesn't do anything on the board. Yeah. I mean, it lets us play Seasons Past and Prey Upon what could have been. But if we drop Seasons Past, we can play the land anyway. Play the land anyway. Uh, we will. Yeah, that's true. Although, do we have a land in our graveyard? We have an island. Well, then, in that case, we can Seasons Past and play a two drop. Yeah. I don't know what. I guess grapple. Grapple. But we probably don't grapple because we'd want to Prey Upon. Mm -hmm. And then he does that. And he exiles the 6-6 six -six this time. Yep. And has his own 6-6. Six -six. But then we, we kill him. We have the kills? We have the kill. Big time. Big time. Because we get the spirit here. We don't have... We don't have the kill without the spirit, do we? No, I'm just going to cast it. doesn't matter what he exiles. Yep. You're dead. Game two. Because you block two things and they're this and this, and you take four. Mm hmm. Do you know he's dead? Yeah. He must know. Does he know he's dead? Oh, I don't know. I mean, it's chewing it to his time. This is fine with me. Nine fifteen. That's fine. Oh, we super win. Well, I'm not even shell that really either. No. Yeah. There we go. Do we want <laughs> root out? I mean it doesn't give the creature back. And grip spoon. Doesn't do anything against Yeah. So no. The, the like the the reason to have it is is if you can keep an equipment off the board, you can never activate the missionaries. But that seems very niche to actually bring in the. And if he has the equipment, we could finish. bring in the clip wings. Because it's good against the Griffin. And he did have a couple other flyers. He had Don Griff, Don Griff, and something else. I think it was just Don Griff. Was it, it was just Don Griff? Oh yeah, Don Griff and um. Mm, I don't like that. Uh, we could. Go with. No, it's insane. It would have been insane in that game specifically. Because of the one big flyer. Because of the missionaries. But that's like anything he puts a, a Griff Spoon onto. It's just killing the thing and then he gets a Griff Spoon back? And if it doesn't have any. But like, you, you'd put your Griff Spoon onto your biggest thing. But then if he doesn't have the Griff. But the, the issue is that the Clip Wings is dead in our hand otherwise. Yeah. You know, imagine how different that game was if he didn't have Griff Spoon. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm just kind of spitballing. Here. I want to see more flyers. From There's me. also the option of Woodcutter's Grit. Which is decent against the trigger. From I've seen the missionaries, I don't, I don't hate that. I don't hate that. That the issue with that though is is you have to do it on end his step. end step, so you're you're kind of just using it as three mana counter and ability. Yeah, that sounds like kind of weak. Yeah, I think we're okay. I think I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay. We have drag under and prey upon and the thing, all that stuff to do with that crap. Got missing, and you can't really prey upon. I guess it's too big. It's a six six. Prey upon with a dire swine, but it's not ideal. Yep. I'll hold on to this. It'll be a little sketchy, but fine on the draw. draw. Fine on the draw with a 1 3 to hold the fort down for I mean, a while. Maybe. I hate that phrase. Hold the fort down? Yeah, because it doesn't mean anything. Yeah. The fort's not going to float away. It's I'm, hold the fort. <laughs> hold down. I know, I know, I know it's the American version of the expression. And if, I, if I'm honest, I could care less, okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a bold move, Cotton. Just played the staff on turn two. That's not unreasonable. Come on. I think it was a good draw. Yeah, great draw. 
We have the ability to do the mana advantage again if he does have the missionary. If we draw a, a land before turn four, we can go Stitch Mangler into Eight of the Hard Swarm. There we go. We can go Stitch Mangler into Eight of the Hard Swarm on let's, turn four. Let's do that. We do Stitch Mangler this turn. And then attack. Although we could have attacked anyway, but this prevents a million damage. Mm -hmm. Possibly. Well, what, four. Four to six. <laughs> four to six. And then next turn, it will still be tapped, which means. Oh. Nope. Which means we get a free attack. With their Mangler. Two, three before we sack it to the Well, hardest. I could just play a creature. You could just play a creature. Well, why would you do that? You I know, creatures, right? right? You have the, the forest with the stag now, too. Stag eats the wolves. Okay. Sweet. We still do our attack. Absolutely. They're both good attacks. Good thing we didn't bring in clip wings. Yeah. And then swarm it up. Now, the issue here is it just makes a thrifty fire. But how bad is that for us? We drag, on. we drag under this really good, actually. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What I'm afraid of is the missionaries. No, no, no. The, I mean, that's gonna be that that uh, braised by wolves is gonna be jump with insects. <laughs> jump with insects. Do we even? Do we just take four? I think puts this on it. Then yes. I imagine he's putting this on a flyer or playing something else though. Mm -hmm. If we draw a land, we get to kill the brazen wolves. Yeah. Unless he does end up equipping it. But I don't know why he would do that. Yeah, it makes more sense. Interesting. It's got to be worth sacking into for four life here. Considering we would be taking H and we go. Yeah, no, that, that seems correct. Dragon just finds, not great because he just puts it on the other spirit. But that does cost him another three. Mm hmm. Can we draw a card of that? The spirit's dead. Mm. Should bring Fiend. Okay. Land. Hmm. Awkward. Okay, so we drag under. Do we wrap the fast? Uh. For our land? Or we could drag under and see about a land for grapple. Dragon is probably more important, right? Drag under is more important. Like I don't mind if we don't get to grapple this turn. Now it is more likely that we hit the land off the grapple than the dragon. Yeah, of course. But I still think. Cool. Now we just don't need to grapple. Well, when we do grapple, we can get a creature now. Yeah, we grapple for mangler. Or whatever we or want. Or whatever we hit, I suppose. Uh, what What are our attacks? These two. I like the one three on defense. Oh, I guess then these two. Because that, that actually dissuades this. Yeah. So, and we might not jump this, I don't know. We don't jump this because we can kill it next turn. Mm -hmm. Points got down to two cards, three cards. Fortune Saver refills our hand as well. We're taking a lot of damage. Um, only if he spends his turn to equip the Spirit up again. We take seven. Yeah, no, like, we're going to be on a low life total, but him equipping it goes a long way to us stabilizing. Yep. Because we just have more mana than him. You know, he's... Oh. I guess now that gets in. So he hits us for nine. Yeah. I mean, we hit back for six. And then we chew up the wolves. And then the and then the stag trades for the gibbering fiend. Do we trade this thing for four life? I don't think so. At this stage, I don't think it does anything. I, I would just do it. You think? Okay. I don't think that's bananas. We just we just want to focus on stabilizing at a life total where we can actually win the game from there. Do you know? Right now. No, that wouldn't have been that bad. Not a good turn play. Um if he he can as well equip to the flyer. He has to spend time to do that again though. He's gonna go oh, equip to that. Just big big chunk of damage. Uh it doesn't have delirium yet, does it? No, no, not even close. That's fine. You wanna get this stitch mangler back? Or Mangler, I think. Oh, we milled the seasons pass. We're so yeah. unlucky. I think it's Mangler. Yeah. We just want the tempo, right? That's what it's we're going for. Definitely Mangler. Yeah, yeah, no. It's going for grade A tempo. Like they're the same card, but Mangler is better. Yeah, we're fighting this. Yep. I mean, Mangler doesn't. Mangler comes in tapped. If that's a thing, I don't I think, think it's a thing. Really, is a thing. Mangler yeah. currently trades for the two, three, the three, two as well. Yeah. I think we can attack. We can't. Yeah. I think we totally can. What are we attacking with? The 4 4. Do we not take a bunch of damage? No. We trade this for either this or this. We trade this for the equipped creature. Mm -hmm. And then we. 
um, like maybe maybe jump, but we take four. Okay. And we're hitting for four. Okay. Which puts him to nine, and then us down. But then you know, then we play six six, or then we free something. You Probably know. free something. Well, for I think we just play just, just play the six six. It just eats all the stuff now. I'm just afraid of the flyer killing us. I suppose. With the delirium, we're also close to dead from the fiend. Ah, he has to put two more cards in his bin. Then he's only got two in hand. Like, well, the warp landscape's one. I suppose he has to put an instant, or I suppose an enchantment, but an instant. Maybe. Well, that's bad. We need block. Yep. And then we kind of need a land. Play swine to hold everything off for a turn, then we freeze this and try. Ugh! Boy, I'm stuck. Boy, oh boy. We're dead, right? Nah. Niblis. No, we're not. Oh, no, yeah, just. M Mangler comes in tapped. Yeah, he just shifts the equipment and kills us. Yeah, we're dead. I suppose we could have fortunes favored for. What? <laughs> Mutation? Still, uh, still dead? No, we're not dead then. Mutation. No, because we can do it in response to... Or we can do it during combat on whatever's, on whatever's equipped. equipped. yeah. But then we're dead after that, because we got up to... We don't have anything after that, yeah. Run it back. Probably. Don't think we want the clip wings, don't think we want the root out, so run it back. I would love to play first, thank you. I can keep that. Yep, I'm, I'm really into that. I want another forest, but I also want to draw the cheap things, so... Anything is okay except islands and seasons pass at this stage, I think. I guess the dire spine's bad, too. Yeah, so expensive cards on islands are bad draws. Everything else is good. Hmm. Grapple the pass off the top. I'd even take a fog walker. Okay, it's a little, it's a little scary. That's a great draw. That's a really good draw. Three drop, four drop, five drop, flyers. And then follow it up with, like, gone missing. Or stag. Nah, I want an instant. Or sorcery. Or sorcery. But not just any no Ooh, no turn two land, friendo. Uh, he kept a one lander? And a terrarian. Niblis. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, he can't really... You need two mana. Terrarian doesn't make a ton of sense to keep up with a one lander. He need to use two mana to make the terrarian. I really like Thraven Gargoyle. I love that card. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. I don't like it. <laughs> You're a piece of shit. <laughs> I love it, love it, love it. <laughs> I don't like it. I love it, love it, love it. Uh oh. So good, it hurts. Nice. Well, actually, no, but. Eh, it's a fifth land. It allows us to curve properly. Meh. Not into the stag, but it allows us to curve. Not into the stag yet. Yeah, we can still draw first. I also just love like an instant sorcery. You know, just any of those. Hit him for seven. Freeze the thing. Presumably, Fire. get whatever the effect of the thing is. Bloodbriar. No land. Incendiary flow. That's annoying. But what you gonna do? First. Nope. Stitch That's fine. Another land is playing two three drops next turn. Hmm. So we're once again at the position where everything except season pass is a great draw. <laughs> and the st and the big pick. Oh, and I suppose um, the double green wolf. Yes, that's also not very good. Brazen wolves. Forest, 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 forest. Let me eat the brazen wolves. Let me eat the brazen wolves. Mm. <laughs> oh, I play the other two. Play two, three drops. Just gonna Just smash them in the air, yeah. I mean, this hits back pretty hard. Not as hard as we are. No, not even close. Well, close. We're attacking for five this turn, but we'll be attacking for seven. Seven, next, at least. You know, instant yeah. sorcery is notwithstanding, and forest notwithstanding. Blop. He's also on 11. <laughs> yeah, no, we're in a good spot here. You know, instant sorcery is what? We attack for then, what? Nine? No. Like drag under's insane. That's almost just a win. It's 
one off, isn't it? No. Forest and Sons I guess any other creature is also fine. Great. <laughs> ah, what did I say? So we drag under the two one. Yeah. Whoop. Yeah. Just threw your shit on the ground. It's all right. I threw it on the ground. Bum, 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 Hit instant sorcery with this. Yeah, that'd be just lethal. With literal, air. literal win. No dice. Wrong land as well. Yeah. Hold that one. Force the jump. Yep. Is there any reason to? Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. It turns a delirium on. No, no, he's already got Terrarian. Oh, he's already got Artifact, sorry. Oh, a creature. It's his first creature to die. Yeah. Which is interesting. Ooh! He also can't replay the white card. That is true. <laughs> I didn't think about that. That's kind of funny. We won the we won the A4. We won the A4. Well, thank you for watching. This I've, has been an interesting one. Yeah, it's been a weird one. A bit, a bit kind of... Yeah, some, some technical difficulties. This is happening to me a lot, where I'm winning 8-4s with decks that probably aren't very good. I wasn't overly enthusiastic about that deck. No, it, seemed it, was, okay. we, it was just good solid play. Yeah, we did it. We got we really it. lucky as well. We did get really lucky times. at several points. We got quite unlucky at several points as well. Also true. We milled uh, that season's pass more times than we were due. Yeah, no, 100%. Uh, but yeah, that was a lot of fun. Uh, I'm really enjoying this format. Me too. Both I'm drafts I've done of it have been great. Um, I'm 31 in and I'm still having a good time. So Which that's... is a big test. Like, uh, okay. Um, better than Shadows of the Strad, yes or no? Maybe a little bit. You think better than Shadows of Vernestrad? Maybe a little bit, yeah. I really enjoyed Shadows of Vernestrad. Me too. So that's, that's high praise indeed. Mm, yeah. Now, uh, you know, that is honeymoon phase of a draft format. Honeymoon phase, 31 drafts in. Well, whatever. All right. I'm, all right, listen. Thank you for joining us. <laughs> yeah. And we'll see you next time.